I this is the third video on the transit that I'm going through with Mercury. You know, it, it's away from Pisces, which is like it's away from being way under the ocean and is kind of doing a volcanic eruption um, with it moving into Aries. Being Mars ruled, there's an aggressive communications that's bound to happen with the side of the organism. Uh, let's say, look, look at the chart, the Aries. Wherever Aries falls in your chart, you're going to have a lot of mercurial activity. Mercury, uh, that's where the it's going to be going retrograde for the next two months. It's going to be in, in Aries. And this tells me that for the entire um, organism, which is you would want, we would like to think is humanity, um, really, I am humanity. And um, say it. Can you say it? I am humanity. Another cool thing to say is, um, now that we're talking about Mercury, and I'm here finally piping up after, whew, wow. I, I, I like the Pisces planets, and, 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 so, and so also the, um, the Aquarius. So we have Venus moving into Pisces really soon here. Um, that is really wonderful for the feminine. See, I was making these videos about trying not to be biased at all. Uh, because there's a glitch in the organism that isn't as put together as the the side that you can see both. See, the word she has he in it. The word uh, female has the word male in it. The word woman or women has the word man or men in it. So now you see both there. If there is just one, there's a vital part of the whole missing. Now that's something that the interfacing system that is um, the English alphabet, which spells out the English words that we all have had to use. Even Chinese people are like, hello, how are we doing today? Uh, there's a reason. It's because it's... Um, we're moving into outer space now. The truth of truths are found there. It includes what's just beyond your nose. See, I can go like this, or I can go like this, and there's your crotch. <laughs> I'm just kidding. I'm sorry. There are men and women here. I mean, plain and simple. And if you and, and if you want to talk about other scientific anomalies, which is all science, if we were looking at the truth, come on, um, that's really what it is. Yep, chalk it up. Some people are kind of, it's, you know, it's like, oh, that's rare. Anyway, God, babes, the, the, the basic, the, the real equation, oh, God. Nobody's making it up, okay? It's already here. All we have to do is rub our eyes a little bit and look at it. It's very interesting, you know, so, uh, but... Yeah, the deeper you go, the more you're getting into the non-physical resonation of of our existential reality. And this is where instant healing is possible. This is where you're getting snapped back into your intellectual belongings, which is beyond the capacity of your mind. Your mind is just a receiver, says Tesla. You know, I have to every once in a while says, says Tesla or Mahatma Gandhi or, or otherwise... Barbie here doesn't say anything. And that's an insult to the truth, really, and your own faculties. Can you just remove the so-called person and the fact of, of maybe that... Um, well, no, really, uh, the who. Remove who. Who. There is no who. Not more so than that there's a how. How isn't a question. Who is always going to be a question because it's like, until and we do our 40 day and 40 night hike out into the desert, oh my God, and then now you're figuring out, wait a minute, there's a real self, capital S. I was explaining this in my last videos that I'm going to put right here and right here and my main purpose of this darn video, God, it is... It is um, a little bit too easy, and that's why the world is as, is as complicating as it is. 
um, is because that's the only thing left to do. It seems like, you know, you don't want to really just hit it, hit the nail on the head because then we'll have to get an actual human civilization going and, and uh, um, well, responsibility, the word responsibility comes to mind immediately. And all that to me is, I know if you really want to want to know free, what freedom is, um, you want responsibility, you want total responsibility, you want to be free, huh? I, I just reflected on uh, some of the people who are taking their freedom around here. And I think it's through money deals that they're just saying. And then there it also comes with the erroneous, very childish communications. I don't want to pick on them too much, but they're actually dangerous because they just, they're poisoning the place. They're, and now when we back up, when I say the place, I'm going to take my personal self out of, and, and you spying on me. The earth, the earth, that, that they're poisoning the earth. And it's like, wait a minute, you can do different things. You can even lay down lava rock instead of fucking asphalt, shitheads. Just straight intruding on your own opportunity to become a better presence. Not just here. We have the whole universe as a possibility. It's always a question here. Will the human being, will there even be human beings? And then will they fucking claim their intellectual belongings, which is outer space, which is what? Let's start with, and now we can remove the hand, get brave. You have a spacesuit on. How do you like mine? I found out that in this realm, even the Chinese, black people, it seems that every color, race, I was going to say hair, but race, is, is, um, is bound to dress up like me. They, they dye their hair the same color. I don't want to show you my body, but it, it, it it's kind of geometric, and it's like they want that geometry. But 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 so I'm five I'm five eleven. I'm not bragging or anything. I'm just telling you the fact, the statement that is made here as a physical embodiment. Everybody ends up dressing like me, and it's like, cool, oh, I guess. But do you really want to be a member of of where I come from? Outer space. The final frontier. <laughs> oh God, this this race thing, you know, where um, the Earth people and the Water people actually is the, is the Black people. Um, the, you know, it's it's a big. They're doing the narcissistic. Ah, uh, they're snapping back. They're like, ah, you fucking. And now it's all racism across the board. And it's like, oh God, the white people. are most of us are innocent, but we're being influenced by, and and the possibility of the organism really knowing, say, its intellectual belongings and how on a very fundamental le level um, is reality rendering, how does the universe work via becoming human? Because the universe is 100% human. What part of one in the statement, we are one with the universe, do we not understand asking for a possibility coming up here? Um, the the white people, you know, that we're having to listen to the black people say, Psh, we are the, you know, because color, color is more potent. Color, human, hue means color, man, us, black, color, and it's like, babes. Um, Yes, there are human, possible humans here. All kinds of colors. That's what it means. Bunches. And not only that, we're talking about different person, person, personalities. Really, it's just your emotions. You're going to live by feeling. Possible human. Possible. Double uh, W. I'm sorry, there's one U there, but you want to double the U. Double the U. There's two. <gasps> Double the you, there's two. Not you, me, he, she, or me, or... No, wait, how, 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 come on, I'm making this song right in front of your face. Um, no, there is we, there's no I, me, he, or she. 
there's we. We is a biological experience as a you, E-W-E. -E. And the Y-O-U is an equation. If you want to know scientifically what the Y is, it's a conduit. Look at, this is joy, by the way. Put your hands in the air like this, please. It's so different. You're now reaching into the heavens. You're, you've put your five points out. You have five points and then you have other five points for some reason. Uh, let's get back into geometry. Um, of what I was trying to sing and say, you know, when you start getting closer and closer to the truth, it begins to rhyme on its own. Um, so then now let's get back to um, Y-O-U. That's an equation, Hans. And listen to the sound of it. Listen to it. It's a question. Why owe you? Why should I give what I have to you? Can you owe me? See, because O, O is a divine um, symbol. Not an O, it's a round, it's a circle. And it's a symbol that represents forever land, recycling, and everything. If you look at it, if you can just, it seems like if you just look at it, I mean, our bodies are full of it. Um, the, you know, when you look at it in a certain way, um, our fingers, like if, if I hate to say it, but if you cut it, it's a circle, you know, it's old, you know, our, our heads are, we have a, okay, a structure around us that is circular. It's um, the, the Taurus, you know, the, the tetrahedron, I think is ultimately um, looking circular, the, the water field just came up. You know, when you throw water up into the space in front of you, if you've ever looked at it, I've looked at it all my life. You know, I was able to play with the hose and you, and you look at it. And, you know, I, I, if you have more and more awareness, things can be slowed down in slow motion and you're observing. Each drop, and even the bigger ones, they want to assume the shape of a circle. Everything, and so, but everything wants to do this. If it becomes more and more liquid, it's becoming more and more the, sh the shape that embodies all possibilities, I would say. Because I know that music is um, the shape of a circle. It's actually a mandala. If you were to really look at real music in front of your face, and it's not written down the way you're flipping pages. It's actually a, a twisting mandala. If there's any kind of timing involved, which usually, which usually there is, and... I know that that's just, that's what I know about this, which helps us because we need to be geometric. We need to be um, orderly, sorry. Orderly? There's plenty of chaos, see. There's plenty of chaos and we are to create out of it. And the there is tone. Um, tones um, are, are their own little bubbles of chaos, you can say. And from there, you can pull up the potent uh, material that is there available as a possibility. Each tone. Uh, so music is just creating harmony out of those tones, um, which is ultimately oscill um, an oscillation of vibrational frequencies that is mathematically sound. Um, what I mean is it's harmonizing. Uh, um, it's... it's um, Ultimately, you can just see this design that becomes very geometric. If indeed, it's it's the kind of song that a child can actually go. They just keep going boom, 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 boom. See the bass is, you know, you can you can put this on a wheel. 
and it will have its timing. Um, that's just a fact in any way. Um, it will teach you, you know, that's what I had difficulty with playing with egos that don't know music is the teacher or the only one teaching us in the room. And if you had anything real, first of all, you want to relax and be able to communicate and because it is a communication that is in and of itself using its own language and its own and it's its its own intelligence. It's its own intelligence. If you can hear me. Ah, uh, God, I'm going on this tangent, but um, see, it's hard to work with narcissists doing anything. They don't know that the truth um, will make you more intelligent than just assuming something because you want it so bad or something like that. It's like you. It takes time to get to know the things that you're holding in your hand and getting attention for. Uh, and to um, end up putting it down. So you're going to put it down because it's not as real as you, who um, you have an inner experience um, and there's an outer, and, and that includes your body. You know, you got to look at this temporary experience and then say, what in the hell is all of this pride parading worth? Even if I do, like Tesla, even if I do know how to, to build a tower, see, the babes, we can get this. I'm here to tell you, I know I'm bouncing all around here, but I'm having a Mercury transit. It's all my, it's, it's just, it's just getting out of my 12th house, right over my ascendant at six degrees, hitting, going into rebirth of the first house is all of humanity is kind of experiencing this with their communications level. If you notice in your life, there's a lot more communications that, that has to go on, that will go on. It's called raw communications because we got, it, it's an Aries and it's Mars and it's very aggressive in getting the job done. What is the purpose here? What are we doing? Because um, whatever they're doing, they just want to really get it done aggressively and get it done on an industrial level, and it's like, even if it's relaxing now, can we relax? Yes, now, now we're going to fucking relax like Mars does. Well, usually they're climbing a mountain and and playing sports and doing a leisurely, um, riding a wave over there on the Maverick, um, Pike. Anyway, um, pipeline. Um, thanks for listening. Uh, wanted, I was trying to talk about, and this is 18 minutes now, um, something obvious, of course, we would beat around the bush, but really it's, it's just geometry and it makes more sense. Now, why would it make sense that Jesus Christ was a woman? Uh, well, we're pointing at the cure, um, for, um, uh, <laughs> I was going to say man's diseases. <laughs> Not that women have that problem, too, but but they do. See, that's the thing is that I really don't want to sound biased here, but I'm just looking at math. Um, how that? Let's see how that a woman. Um, God, I don't know why I'm having. I feel like I'm having this conversation alone. How many people are on here? You want to, you want you want to know about narcissism? And it's like, well, did you know that narcissism is has always been known to be the man's disease. It's a mental disorder that basically it's just the fully encapsulated mind. They are more prone. And if you look at it, it's the dominating philosophy that says, damn it, I'm more real and we approach it like this. Even if it's a discipline that says, now we have to shut down these senses uh, that that is connected to the mind and giving you all these sensations. Really, it's like, really? Yeah, do that, please, because you have other five senses. Your body is here. And in case this is in case you want to get involved with, like I said, you have a spacesuit. Now we have reality, outer space, the final frontier where uh, apparently no man has gone before, but uh, uh, <coughs> women. I don't want to stop it here, but I... I, I'm always onto something when I stop it. And come on, please. 
I only have so much time here, and it's just an obvious thing. I'm looking at it like, and no wonder the the um, there's a lopsided problem. There's 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 something going on that's oh god, it's too bad that like half of us would say, what is this woman? so mentally ill over him. I'm like, no, I'm not, babe. There is spiritual illness, there is physical illness, and there's mental illness. And the people that are talking like this and, and, and looking at you, and you can't have this conversation, they are way more healthier than you. You're the problem, I bet. What the fuck program are you and what's your conversation like, really? Some people, and it's 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 a split, right? It's a split, and I'm thinking, ah, where where are we gonna go then? Because I see that I'm sandwiched. It's it's a trip. We have a we have the box, and then we have like a a, a U a horseshoe. That's me, and then there's another box. There's other horseshoes. There's a couple other boxes. And, and I understand you want to keep your dogs in. But then again, you, you're, um, you're not an energet, you're not aware of energy like, say, the ones that are a you, that are, might be holding energy. Um, uh, open for it, um, knowing that we, we must remain a you. The, the shape of a you is like a cup. Because you're going to get a full, you pour, you're pouring it, you must, must, you, us, t, Ruth, t, m, m, men, women. See, I have to be careful not to ever seem like I'm leaning into a bias. It's like, no, I'm trying to include both of them here. That's the cure. That's the cure. Turn Jesus into a woman. It will make so much more sense because then, well, why did they kill it off? I mean, um... Why do they call it a sacrifice? All this stuff like this, trying to make sense out of it in front of the kids, for once and for all. I can, I can, I, I can. Watch these two videos. Watch all my videos. There's a thousand five hundred of them. 